Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Uh, there's a fire right up here. Oh my God, this hasn't happened at this dealership ever. Oh my God. I can already feel the heat from this thing. Dang. So I'm gonna set this down. I got a, a fire extinguisher. I'm gonna try to put this out. It's probably not gonna work, but I'm gonna attempt. But hey, before I begin to show you the rest of this fire in this car, absolutely amazing. We have some new merch, these Chevy Dude American flag key tags straight from the supplier right now. We got the Chevy Dude autograph on the back, American flag, black and white there. They're on ChevyDudeStore.com. I just used this ABC just to kind of try to knock it down a little bit. Didn't really help. I kind of thought it was going to help a little bit, but uh, yeah, things gonna, things going pretty good. And here's the issue as a firefighter for a long time they're gonna have problems getting back here i'm gonna kind of direct them which way to go here so that way they can get in here correctly i'd have like three more fire extinguishers i probably could put that out but it's not gonna work it's just tires So now our uh, Camaro is on fire now. So you're gonna probably hear an explosion or two coming up soon. And uh, I shut the camera off to do something else. And I shouldn't have done that, but you're gonna hear an explosion or two come up pretty quickly because uh, the tires are gonna pop. You can see the uh, bumper melting on that car. Brand new 2019 Camaro. I know a lot of questions are gonna be asked what's gonna happen to that car. That car will be insurance claim and salvage. Hey, the best uh, up and around make a U-turn. You have your hook and ladder uh, coming. Yeah. So they're going to have to come straight in right here. Back, come up right there and get up. Back, uh, <clears throat> I was just talking to the fire department. So here comes their engine. Uh, Jefferson Town Fire Department actually has a uh, hook and ladder system. <clears throat> so they're going to come up here. You can get right up there and put that fire out. You can hear the Camaro horn going off now. So if I didn't say it, there we go. There's that boom I was gonna tell you about. So that was just a tire exploding. And oh, I, uh, that's a sold car right there. I need to get that out of there. That's one of my customers going to California. Just heard that beep, beep, beep. But that was uh, their SCBAs kicking on. You have to worry about these fire, these uh, lines up here, power lines. The lower ones are always uh, utility lines like phone or cable. Those are the hot ones up there that you gotta worry about. That one possibly could be hot, I highly doubt it. Yeah, it is.
another economy tool here that's going to pop that um, deck lid. Gotta love a spreader. Okay, yeah, the Suburban's right there, so, or the Tahoe's right up there. All right, so it looks like the fire is suppressed. I actually just found out this is an employee's car. <laughs> Where have you been, man? You're too, you're too late. You're supposed to be in charge around here, aren't you? <laughs> I think those uh, black cars will buff out. Oh, yeah, yeah they'll, they'll, they'll be fine. <laughs> It's actually an employee's car. Yeah. All right, so there you have it. I found out that this was an employee's car. And uh, unfortunately, I sell a lot of these guys' cars. I know a lot of these guys at J-Town. And uh, so I kind of joked with a couple of them on camera if that part gets into the uh, video. Uh, but I did it just because I know these guys, firefighter for a long time before getting into the car business. And uh, it's just part of the nature. So uh, employee's car, hopefully, uh, can get a new one we'll help them out here as much as we can those two cars that caught on fire next to it um, if I don't put that part in earlier I've mentioned it earlier in the video but uh, what will happen with those is that uh, they'll be insurance claimed and they'll be total cars and we won't have them here uh, at all for sale or anything like that they'll just go to Copart probably and you can probably find them on Copart so if you find them on Copart uh, throw me uh, throw me some links or tag me in uh, Facebook or Instagram and uh, if I can I'll put the VIN numbers down in the description below so you guys can look for them all right, so the firefighters are all gone so let's get uh, first look at all of the damage this is one of the cars here Camaro it's trashed completely gone it's crazy cars burn so quick and then this is the car that actually caught on fire. So off camera, I actually did come up here and try to throw a fire extinguisher on it um, just to, I was trying to knock the flames down so it wouldn't hit this because this was not on fire and that car was not on fire, but uh, uh, actually coming to find out, this was an employee's car. And I'm not sure of the story yet because I've been busy. I'm getting back here to take video of it, but whew, crazy, crazy, crazy. This is the other Camaro. Can see that tire's flat so that was one of the bursts that you heard in it the cover there's done uh, oh they popped that hood i'll show you that hood over there i forgot about they popped that so you kind of saw them punching in there punching a hole in there to to ventilate it and stuff like that so it's amazing stuff burns quick so this is that battery powered spreader they used on this to pop this deck lid to get it out as you saw it it didn't take much work to uh get in there and just pop that lid so they get some water in there and kill the fire here is my customer's car this is going to california um i'll tell you what i got some of the best employees that i work with co-workers that i work with and uh they had already knew this car was back there i didn't tell them that that car was sold or anything like that they noticed it and uh, came and got it and just sprayed uh, the junk off the car. There's no damage to it. Uh, we're gonna go over it with a fine tooth comb to make sure there's no issues before this gets shipped to California to my client. Now, my client, luckily, he is a first responder. He is a LA County Sheriff. And uh, so he's been around all this stuff and you know, everything he saw, sees on the video, it's not gonna be a big deal to him, but it's a big deal to me. We're gonna make sure that uh, everything is safe everything is good and make sure there's no issues all right guys there you go kind of an exciting interesting day here at the dealership i had a different video that i was going to put on tonight but this trumped that video so make sure you hit the subscribe button turn your bell notifications on for future videos and then most importantly uh check out the chevy dude store chevydudestore.com it's right there we got these cool stickers we got these brand new keychains i'm launching today in the store got this we got that hat we got this shirt 
And we got these cool sunglasses that you can wear at nighttime. Also, if you want to interact with me and get some great car buying tips, I started a new Facebook group. If you're on Facebook, go to HTTP autobuying.us. The link is in the description below and I'll see you on the next video and in my group. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day and drive safely.